hello beautiful people you're welcome back to my channel if this is your first time hello and welcome to this channel my name is Delapo, and on this channel i share tutorial videos on edwards and um, other crafts so if this interests you why not join the family by subscribing and then um, hit the notification bell so you get notified whenever i upload new tutorials in this video i'll be showing you how to make the trending face fascinator this is a video request by some of you and i hope you all enjoy it these are the materials i'm going to be using for my this is called the plastic millinery wire as you can see it is flexible it's not the metallic one it's called the plastic wire okay so i have other materials using the other side of it okay i'll just place it like this and i'll use my needle and thread to sew through the crinoline and I will just tack it like that tack the end of the wire to it like that so that's just the same way I did this other side okay now I cut out two pieces of crinoline using the measurement 10 inches 10 inches okay and then um, I have it in two places like I said I have it in two places and what I have left is about 13 to 14 inches so i'll just be going ahead to do that so the small two pieces that i cut out i have tied the ends as you can see and i also cut out the plastic wire that will be enough for that uh, for, for the one side and i'm going to use my needle and try to tack it just like i we did the other just like i did the bigger piece earlier so i'll just tie tack it to my crinoline on both sides like that I'll be doing the same on the second piece so as you can see I have my crinoline ready and I'm going to be using my bar strip to cover the edges you notice I use a different color of the bar strip to do this just for it to have uh, two different colors you could use the same color 
of your crinoline so i'll be using my ua glue to attach or to cover our rough edges okay like that i'll be doing this on the other two pieces as well I pick the second one and I attach it to it like that. Okay, this third piece you're seeing is a crinoline spiral. Okay, I have a video that shows how to make a crinoline spiral design. I'll, I'll put the link in the description box so you can watch if you haven't seen that yet or if you don't know how to make this. Okay, I have a detailed tutorial that shows how to make this. So I'll just coil it like that using my fingers uh, and just turn it anyhow I feel is okay. And I'm going to attach the second half uh, bow. You could make a bow right away. You could just make a single bow. Alright, just cut your fabric instead of cutting it into pieces. Just cut the required length and form a bow like that. And attach it to it as you desire. Okay, so this is how I made my own um, face fascinator. Just go ahead and tack several times so as to have it very firmly. I have my thread doubled multiple times and I'm wrapping it over um, the base of the comb. This is actually optional. If you don't want to, you can leave it for this particular design, okay? But I just wanted to have something to tack my fascinator to, okay? You could leave this part. So I'll just go ahead and use my glue to seal the ends of the thread before I use my needle and thread to attach it to my fascinator as you can see. I'll be using my needle and thread to tack it neatly and then firmly. Make sure that you tack it very very firmly else it may not really stand well. But if you tack it very well then you're good to go. If you are yet to subscribe please do subscribe by hitting the subscribe button tap the notification that's a bell icon beside the subscribe button and turn it on turn on your notifications to receive all notifications so you don't miss out of any of my tutorial videos on this channel and okay you can decide to cover this part with trimmings just to hide your rough edges you can cover the back part with any embellishment of choice yes and as it stands we have come to the end of today's tutorial i hope you enjoy it please like comment and then share this video with all that creative thank you so much for watching i'll see you all in our next video bye